This is Om Solomon Vincent, and yes, I welcome you to this amazing time. And of course, today I'm going to be sharing something very important, which is on how to raise a leader from outside your location. All right, so how to raise a leader who is outside your location. All right, so I've joined, I've had um, people who have joined my business from different locations and I just thought about it. Okay, what were some of the things I did that helped them to grow and become better in their business? And I penned down a few things, so I have a few stuff in my little jotter here that I'd want to share with you some of the thoughts that, uh, things that helped me, the strategies that helped me to raise a leader outside my location. So remember, if you are not subscribed to this channel, turn on the notification bell, subscribe, like, share, do whatever you need to do, but get more content from this channel, okay? And let's get going, all right? <clears throat> so the first, first way to raise a leader who is out from outside your location, number one is religiously take him or her through the standard method of operation. So. You have your system, you have the ways you build leaders in your team, in your business, okay? In our business, we call it the standard method of operation, okay? So you take them through all the activities that he is supposed to go through from the day he signs up to the business up to the day he is uh, considered, uh, what I call it, a master in the business. There are lined up activities that makes the person, we call it a kingsman, okay? So there are lined up activities that you go through that would help you do that. So take him through it religiously. And then have a review, have a review of the activities you are taking him through. So through the standard method of operation, the SMO checklist, review what he or she is doing. So let's say for instance, you told him or uh, you told him to go through um, your first year in network marketing. Do a review. That is, create a Zoom session, create either a WhatsApp call or a WhatsApp video call where you will talk about, okay, so what did you learn uh, from what you read? And then when the person is sharing, then you discuss, you talk about it and bring it to real life situations. Do you understand? All right, so that's the second step. The next thing to do is guide him on the simplest prospecting and invitation scripts or systems to use on a daily basis. What that means is teach him scripts, teach him systems to prospect someone he's meeting for the first time. Teach him or her uh, scripts that will help him invite someone to see the opportunity. All right, so anywhere he's going to, maybe he's going out to work, he sees someone, he knows what to say that will pique the person's interest. He will not know these things if you don't teach him how to do that. You know, the key thing for someone who is just joining the business is to build his database of relationships. Okay, so when you teach him or her how to pick people's interest and connect with people and start a connection, do you understand, with people building a lot of database for his business, that's going to help the person's business to always grow. So you teach him or her the simple scripts and systems to increasing his database of contacts. Very important. The fourth thing is give him or her a prospecting target. Are you getting it? Give him a prospecting target. Tell him, okay, so for a start, let's say two contacts every day. When you go out, make sure you add two new phone numbers to your phone book. One new phone number to your phone book. Three new phone numbers. Just how many do you think you can do? All right, let's start with that. So the quantity you can start, track it and make sure he or she is keeping to that commitment. Are you following me? Very important. Now, teach him the various systems. That is, do the training on systems. Do system training for him or her. And allow the person to choose which of the system is the best, most convenient that he can always use. 
Are you following me? So if it's the contact recommendation, the questionnaire, the flyers, uh, home loan system, online system, which of, all the, which of the system he or she feels is the most effective system he can use based on his commitments, based on his schedule that he can use, based on the time he has created to do the business and finds that this system is the best for me to use, allow him allow her to use that system so you teach the person to master that one he has chosen so if he has chosen to use contact recommendation system or questionnaire system make sure you make that person master that system so that he or she can always use it on demand do you understand that very important now whichever system like i said he uses he chooses to use set daily targets on that particular system track the person put an accountability system to ensure that he is doing the activity your focus is on the activity let the person keep doing the activity that is in line with the system he or she has chosen out of the systems you taught him or her do you understand so he has chosen a particular system set a target for the person and track the production based on the target you have set and let there be accountability now when we talk about accountability there are certain things you can do one of the things you can do is to create what I call a mastermind group now when I say a mastermind group this is what you can do that will help you because someone is in a distant location, you will need peer pressure. The person will need peer pressure to see that, oh, someone else is doing this thing, oh. someone else is actually doing this thing, oh. okay? Someone else is, 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 is crushing this target that was set. Do you understand? So that peer pressure in what I call the mastermind group, where you can have a once in a week review, and that new person joins the review and then you now ask okay so what about you what were you able to do this week and the person says what he did and he listens to others do the same thing and how much they were able to produce do you understand it puts some form of peer pressure on the person do you understand and the person needs those things to grow in the business so if you're here and you have teammates or you have you have signed up someone who is outside your city and the person wants to do the business but you don't know what to do you don't know the things to do that will help the person to grow this is for you so make sure you share it with your teammates who are also building their business outside their current location okay it's a big opportunity my upline when he joined the business, his own upline was not in the same city as he was. His upline was in Abuja. He was in Enugu. Now imagine it. Today, my upline has built a massive business for himself. Why? Because his upline knew exactly what to do to make him a leader even though they were not in the same location. So the fact that someone is not in your location does not mean that the person cannot be a powerful leader in this business. Are you following me? Now, the last thing I'm going to talk about is ensure that the person always joins cell meetings, joins Melonia school trainings. Let the person create a habit of doing cell meetings it could be a physical cell meeting it could be online cell meeting if there is any office the person can go to and engage in the physical cell meeting beautiful but if there is none make sure the person joins and connects to the online cell meetings and that will help the person grow in knowledge as far as this business is concerned all right so if you have any special question based on this of course you can drop it on the chat uh, on the comment section and it will be attended to and of course go through the channel watch trainings listen to things that will help you improve your business listen to systems that will help you grow your business it's already a new year it's an amazing year we have ahead of us and of course I believe so strongly that you can create massive success for yourself if you understand the strategies that will help you create success regardless of where your individuals are located. 
Let's have a great day. God bless you.